Organisations are simply having to respond to changing customer needs and requirements. Um, since COVID, our people want to do things online. They want to do it at their convenience. Um, government still has many processes that um, have on in-person requirements. We do have forms, but there is a real concerted effort within government to make sure that people who need our services can access them more easily. And there's a lot of work being done behind the scenes um, to make sure we can join up some more of our systems and make them more readily available. Um, some of those commitments include um, a digital identity that users can access and link that to our federal government identity system so that you can essentially log in once and you don't have to keep sharing your information with us again and again. Some of the things we are working on to really improve customer experience is by asking our customers what they need. So we've really embedded user-centred design into the way that we design our new services. So for example, for our um, citizen identity solution, we have a panel of users, people in our community who represent our community that we ask, we get them to test the solutions, we get them to beta test, does A or B work better? And I think in that way, we're starting to build more responsive services and that better aligned to what our governments need. I would say that this practice would be replicated across SA government um, in a number of agencies doing really interesting work. I'm really delighted to be back again um, at the Innovate SA conference in South Australia. I think it's such a great opportunity to bring public servants together with our suppliers and partners to really talk about how do we keep making things better for our community. Um, innovation is a process. Um, in my keynote this morning, I spoke about having a, a culture of psychological safety where failing and experimenting is encouraged because without failure and experimentation, we can't improve and we can't innovate. So I think that that opportunity to really connect with peers, um, to rem remember that we are in a large organisation, our public sector is 107,000 people strong. There's a lot of pockets of best practice and great work being done. So the conference is a great platform to make sure we connect our people, make some new connections so we continue to de deliver value to the South Australian community.